I had a dream of going to college. My parents knew that I would be able to somehow figure it out and they always encouraged me to go for that. But we had no money and we had no time because I had to work, I had to provide for my family. My family and I came to this country as refugees from the Ukraine. At that time, we were part of the former Soviet Union. I was 18 years old. My brother was only five. My parents didn't speak English. And it was a really rough start at first. We had two bags of clothing per person and $650. That's really all we had. My parents were highly educated parents. Our family had high value for college education and that's something that was very important to me to get college uh, degree so I was really determined to do that. I went for college options that I could afford. After college almost by chance I got an interview at McKinsey and I ended up working at McKinsey and then Providian and JP Morgan Chase and PayPal. Currently I'm Chief Marketing Officer at Big Commerce. We are an e-commerce software platform and I don't think I, could be, I would be able to get to my current job or even the jobs that I was able to get after I got from, graduated from college without getting college education. There's so many great options that, are in, that offer lower cost, in-state tuition and provide great education and also allow people like me who needed to provide for their families to work during the day and go to school at night. Keep doing it. Uh, you, uh, my, my advice to to people who have to work through their way through school or keep two jobs. Do what you need to do, but definitely keep going for that college education. Take your general education classes at a local city college so you can at least save money during that time period. Can you go for schools that offers classes at night so that you can go and work during the day? And it's amazing how incredible the experience is when you are combining your work experience and your education experience, you get more hands-on learning and you're also surrounded by classmates who also work during the day bringing that experience to the classroom. And as you do all of this, no matter how hard it is, just keep on dreaming. And if you're doing all of this, you're working and you're going to school, I can guarantee you, you'll be successful. The definition of success for me changes over time. When you feel that you have enough money to pay the rent, that's the first time you feel you made it a success. When you feel you landed that first job, even though it's an entry-level job, but you landed that job, even though you don't speak great English, you feel like that was a success. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.